is the number one producer of pumpkins in the world. We usually only think about pumpkins during one small part of the year, but the pumpkins we enjoy in the fall were thought about by pumpkin farmers for many months before they ended up carved and on our front porches or in our pies at the dinner table. A lot of time, preparation, and hard work goes into growing and harvesting pumpkins. The pumpkins we use as an ingredient when baking pies and other treats are called processing pumpkins. They are lighter in color and more oval shaped than the traditional orange pumpkins we carve for jack-o'-lanterns. The jack-o'-lantern pumpkins are considered ornamental pumpkins, along with other varieties of smaller pumpkins, gourds, and squash that we use to decorate in the fall. So how do we get all these types of pumpkins from the field to our front porch? How are pumpkins harvested? Let's head over to a pumpkin farm that grows pumpkins to find out. Hi kids, I'm John Ackerman from Ackerman Family Farms in Tazewell County, Illinois. This is our pumpkin farm. And you probably wonder, how do we harvest these pumpkins? Our ornamental pumpkins we harvest by hand. And out here we'll harvest as many as 30,000 pumpkins each year, every one of them by hand. We've got to make sure that they don't have any scars or marks on them at all. When they're doing processing pumpkins, that's mechanically done. They do that with machines, and it's a fascinating process. But let me show you how we do it out here. We like to cut the, the vines. We like to knock the dirt off. And there we have one of the many different varieties we grow out here at Ackerman Family Farm. Do you know that we grow over 160 different kinds? And we get our seed from all over the planet. Every continent on the earth except Antarctica. Too cold there, I think. Our pumpkins we grow every year. They grow on vines, which are long, low plants that grow along the ground. They can be up to 30 feet long. As a matter of fact, we measured one one time that was 75 feet long. Look at the size of that vine. They grow in every direction. You know, when we think of pumpkins, we often think of orange pumpkins, like our friends the jack-o'-lantern pumpkins. But did you know there are many different colors and shapes and sizes? There are white pumpkins and red pumpkins, even blue pumpkins. We have yellow ones. There are red bumpy pumpkins, and there are yellow bumpy pumpkins, and there are very, very bumpy pumpkins. Some pumpkins have beautiful stripes, and some pumpkins are very, very big, and some are very, very small. There are ones that are really good to eat, and some that have seeds that are wonderful to eat too. Why, there are so many different types of pumpkins. Aren't they just beautiful? Some of the pumpkins that we grow are grown for food. They take these to the factory and put them in cans so that you can use them for pumpkin pie and other recipes. Now maybe these aren't as pretty as some of the other pumpkins, but they really, really taste good. You have to cook them first, but they are so yummy. Well, maybe, maybe you'll be the person who develops a different type of pumpkin that no one's ever seen before and we'd all love to grow. Maybe you're the person who will develop a new way to plant pumpkins. They'll make it easier for me. Or maybe you're the chef that will come up with a new dish that uses our pumpkins and everyone will want to try it. There's so many jobs that have to do with pumpkins. You might be a farmer that grows them like me. Or maybe you just want to be part of this fun industry we have in Illinois. Thank you so much for listening. Have a great day.